Hmm, so how do I get more steps? Aha, I've got it. Welcome to No Excuses. My name is Mary Fran, and this is my place to talk about weight loss, life, fitness, getting my life on track, taking control, and being amazing. So thank you for joining me. Today we are going to talk about my weekend review, what I'm doing to make myself healthy, fit, and amazing. So let's get to it. So in December, I started my healthy habits and I have a couple habits that I'm working on. The first one is water. And once again, I am doing amazing on this one. I'm drinking my water, if not 64 ounces more water. I would love to say that I did it consistently every day, but on Tuesday, I fell apart. I don't know what happened. I got about 35 ounces in and that was just the end of it. I, yeah, I don't know. It was just done. So Tuesday fell apart, but every other day been perfect. Another healthy habit that I'm working on is tracking my food and eating the correct amount of foods. And I actually tracked every bite that I ate. The weekend was a little bit higher. And once again, on Tuesday, I fell apart and my points were a little bit higher than they need to be. Once again, I don't know what happened on Tuesday. Stress, I, yeah, I don't know. But I am tracking. I am, for the most part, consistently on track. I'm actually okay with that Tuesday anomaly because you see, I'm not aiming for perfection. I'm aiming for sustainability. And if I have a day that's a little bit higher here and there, that's okay. And I do have those weekly points that covered it. I was only a couple points over, so I was actually still 100% okay. And like I said, sustainability, not perfection. This is life. So I'm going to call tracking another win and my eating another win. Little anomalies here and there. So the third habit is exercise. I am going about this in a couple different ways. Number one, I joined the step challenge with Derek's journey. Number two, I'm working to get formal exercise in as often as possible. And when I say formal exercise, what I'm meaning at this point is I'm doing YouTube videos, I'm doing Zumba, I'm doing different exercise videos. And I've been kind of playing around finding out which instructors I like. I did find my Zumba guy that I like. He's really good. He's it just works for me. I like the way he leads. I like his hand motions. It, it's easy to follow for me. I have a couple other that I'm really liking and I'm really enjoying. And so I'm working on those consistently. And I only did not do one day of formal exercise. It was over the weekend. I did not do any formal exercise, but I still got a lot of steps in. In fact, I got a lot more steps that day without exercise than I normally do with exercise. So I guess it's good. As for steps, my goal for the month of January is 8,000 steps a day, and I am actually doing really, really good. If I average out my last week, I'm spot on with my 8,000 steps. Now, let's go back to that Tuesday, because remember with my water, I messed up on Tuesday. With my tracking, I messed up on Tuesday. Oh yes, with my steps, I messed up on Tuesday. Tuesday was just a bad day all around, I guess. I actually only got half of the steps that I needed. However, I've been working it and it's all really good. So I'm gonna call exercise a win also because while I didn't do formal exercise one day, I got my steps in that day. And while I actually didn't do all of my steps one day, I actually did a formal exercise routine. It was still an exercise routine, it just didn't have as many steps in it. So even though I missed the steps and I missed the one exercise, they were on different days and I was still active, I was still doing, I was still good. So go me. Habits are going well. I don't expect perfection and I'm not getting it, but I'm expecting sustainability. And I think my week was quite sustainable. So I went to some great lengths to figure out how to get more steps. We got a dog because, you know, you have to walk a dog, right? Step, 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 right? I introduced Zoe to you guys a couple days ago in a video, and 
she's helping me get my steps because I'm up at four or five in the morning outside with her and I walk in place sometimes when she's just kind of rolling around in the grass having fun. So early morning dog walks are the thing now. In the snow, in the cold, here I am outside walking when she is just laying on the ground enjoying the cold because she is a Newfoundland. I'm just walking in place to get extra steps. So I did my way and it was a couple days back. It was actually at the beginning of this week and I really need to change what day I'm doing my postings because I'm weighing myself on the weekend and then I'm not doing a video until the end of the week, but you know, hey, it's all good. So my first official weigh-in for the year was earlier this week, last weekend, and I lost three pounds. I am tickled with three pounds. I will take it. I love it 100%. I'm there on top of it. I weigh in in about two or three days and I am excited. I can't wait to see what I lose from this week. And I don't anticipate that that Tuesday little anomaly that I just kind of fell apart is going to affect anything because I've been doing really good elsewhere. So I can't wait. Stay tuned because I'll be putting a video up of that as soon as possible and we'll see where I'm at. But in the meantime, I am continuing forward. I'm eating healthy. I'm choosing wisely. I'm moving my body. I'm making me amazing. No excuses.